We go straight into our first uh, topic where we're asking are we as a nation a reckless I mean are we reckless drivers as a nation? Now sorry I can't any what do you think of reckless drivers? Please please come on to Fundisha to Zungu is not correct me. My English teacher is watching No 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 let me tell you I was taught English by the Queen herself. Sorry, sorry, Her Majesty. She just likes talking a lot. I'm sorry, I really apologize. Absolutely because I have I have my grammar correct. Are we a nation Are we a nation of reckless drivers? We ask. Yeah. And what do you think about Kenyan drivers? They've got all the information from the school, but sometimes they know because when they always think that uh, if they are caught by a police, they bribe the police and they will be left away. Apa tuko na kuma junction, eh? Apa hivi kuna roundabout inapita hivi ju. So kulikuwa na jam, the other side. Na hii said ya kuenda tau na hakuna magari. So, somebody just decided to pass the wrong way. Tuka wangwari, haka pita, hii said ya kuenda tau. Halipofika hapu katikati, head on, with another vehicle. So, what did he think? Why couldn't, couldn't uh, Mbona hakufuata the right route? Yeah. Now, will you blame the person who taught that person driving? No. It's just ignorant. We were jam, and we were able to get up. We were able to get up, and we were able to get up. But we were roasters, we were able to get up, and we were able to get up, and we were able to get up. So ndo ni kasema, hey, uja ama kwa hini, alikuwa narakisha naenda wapi? Mbino napata mtu mgini, hako naraka ya kuenda, alafu anataka kuenda mbio sana. Kuna mbini nilisikia kisema, anenda mbio, kitambo yo gari kitaka kwanguka, asimu suriki, ayende kabisa. Hata sisi wenye atutumi magari sa ingine, labda tunatembea. Kwa mfano, ukienda Valley Road, hapo karibu na Nairobi Hospital, hiyo njene njene Nairobi Hospital, kuna flyover juu. Na gari huwa zinaenda kwa kasi sana. Unapata uh, pedestrians. Badala ya kupita flyover juu, wanapita hapa chini. What do you expect? But you know because most of them are afraid of heights. Unaona? Sasa kama wangetengenezewa hii huko chini. Na kuna watu wengine tu wakipanda tu hivi mahali hai wanaanza kutafika, wanapiga magari. Wacha nikuulize swali. Ile ilikuwa huko huko ni ni group cinema si kulikuwa na ile ya pass. Si nilikuwa naona watu wana pass juu. Na sasa sio unaona hizi za underpass eh? Kuna watu wengine wanaogopa gravity. Is the reason why you fly over itengenezo hapo. Kama kuna hiyo underground utapita hapo chini because it's safer. Yeah. So I think we have to change the whole attitude. Uh, Tuko all in agreement that kuna reckless drivers na pedestrians pia wengine ni you know wana reckless. Yeah. But what causes all this? Kuna when you're drunk, when you're drunk you might you might be having that stimuli of hari 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 gari. Huyo anachangia sana. Sababu anaambia derefa anataka 4500 4500 jioni. Na kuna jam. Derefa dio apate mshahara na gari iwe na mafuta na atereke mwenye gari pesa atafanyaje? Si nikukimbisha gari. Okay, stress. Maybe unaweza pata mtu amekuwa sana na bibi yake kwa nyumba. Unaona? Seri azi hizo vitu vingine ndio zinachangia sana. Sana kwa kwa barabara. Ono kikasirika alafu nge kwa barabara Uko na masira zako Umekosa na mtu pale Njoo na ezendesha gari kama umenda wazimu Kitu ngini mimi meona and I think it's very funny Jee bila bidatu umeona Unacheki mtu dereva amingia kwa pavement kabisa Na pas na Wanaitwaje but pedestrians wako kwa pavement But anaingia But also when you ask me Ukiangale a situation like that Mostly you find it's the state of our roads Unapata barabara inatosha na hivi as in practically it's one unaweza kuweka one foot the other foot mbele ndio unaweza kutembea the small small roads zinaingia into the estates yeah so i think the people who are planning didn't expect people to be using like sasa siku hizi hizo zinatumiwa kuhepa jam no so kila mtu akisema ati anataka kuhepa jam wanakutana huko wote so they end up causing another jam there so the, and then so poor planning naona hata barabara ikiwa nzuri kwanza hizi kama highway ukiona imetengenezwa vizuri ndio sasa ina cause maneno mengine accident sa yote sababu speed ndio sasa wanaongeza uh, super highway i can't wait for it uh, thicker road hiyo iko na baka basement first floor nini iko mpaka lift eh? <laughs> 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 ukiwa second floor unashikishwa na parachute kwa matatu and it's gonna be amazing and it's coming but i'm asking unaona pia dry, uh, driving schools they have um, a role to play in all this so those people want to make money so wanakupeleka haraka haraka ukirudisha unaambiwa umesoma ume and then you know passing an exam 
sio shida yeah ya kuandika sio shida so you pass that exam you are given the driving license but you don't have the experience nani wangapi hapa wameshia na driving school okay what what okay madam what and kwa whatever ulifundishwa na practically on the road do you think kweli ina apply ama kuna disconnect fulani sema kweli ya ate kusoma yes we tunasoma lakini sasa tukienda kwa baro tunaona something different you think it should be more practical than uh, theoretical some is theoretical is my science unajua zote unakumbuka sign ile ya mtu amesema nimefanya hivyo unajua ni sign gani hiyo ni sign ya mtu anaomba lift unaona look at our traffic police eh mkigongana una ukiwa out there eh gari zigongane mnaambia tu vizuri mpeleke kando so that traffic endelee huku kugongana na mtu kwa gari traffic police aende achukue mawe aanze ku knock hivi mnaoje because traffic jam eh? they are not doing anything because um the, 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 there will be an accident the traffic police will come and then at the end of the day nini kitafanyika these people won't be charged the, the, the right person okay the, the, the person who is in the wrong maybe will bribe at the end of the day will go scot free kama ni corruption ishe inafaa mtu kisha shiko na polisi mwambie mpelekane mbele unaona but watu wengine wanaogopaga kuna campaign mke na ikuje inaitwa Zusha yeah ya kumbuka kuna driver wa matatu ambao you traveling in ana endesha vibaya sana you're supposed to kumwambia slow down ama wacha kutuendesha hivyo lakini wewe role yako kama mkenya ama kama mwananchi ni nini mwananchi si nilikwambia anafurahia saa ile ngari inaenda bio ndio afike haangalii maisha yake michoki rules came on the on the action everything went perfect but after some time when the michoki went off everything went back to normal again it went back to to the worth so i think It's our it's our responsibility we have to, our, ourselves actually have to refuse and say no apart from these rules yeah like do not drive recklessly there are also these other things that we have not written that are bad so please with your common sense can you just for, uh, not only follow these rules but whatever uh, you see that is not right please don't do it So are we saying that uh, the matatu drivers are the worst drivers the worst than personal you know drive guys driving the personal cars matatu drivers are better than personal drivers because unapata mtu anaenda mtaani anachukua gari for one week alafu anaenda anachukua licenses na mlango wa nyuma anaingia kwa barabara kwa barabara na unajua kwa matatu huwezi enda kwa barabara kama una experience ya 3 years so lakini mtu wa personal car ukiwa na interim unaweza endesha gari ya personal unaona so a driver is a driver personal drivers wanabeba mpaka nyaunyo kwa hiyo kuja mbele yake kwa nani utajua na yoni issue na yoni issue ya road rage ya kuna issues nyingi sana ambazo they cause reckless driving solution ni nini haswa let's say you're a driver you are the one who is at the steering so we have you have to be cautious and don't take your responsibility to someone else saying ah police is you ko hapana it's supposed to be you mimi ndio driver mimi ndio nimebeba abiria sasa lazima ni nijichunge na niwachunge abiria tujue this fake was these are machines so machine once ukipata accident machine haitaumia wewe ndio utaumia kwa the Australians kuna tuseme nao kama kwa flyovers let us use the flyovers mali zimeweka manake those people when waliziweka hapo jam must be a reason as to why waliziweka hapo tasi sima pedestrians when we are using the roads let's follow the rules ya kama ni zebra crossing ndio zebra crossing you have a right to cross but kuna zebra crossing zingine zimewekwa street lights na wamechora hapo mtu amesimama na sasa ingine huyo mtu anatembea so just look at the road lights kama mtu amesimama wait because if you walk yen is zebra crossing lakini mtaulizwa you don't see the lights and some things now which which have uh, okay imechangia sana ni hizi simu sasa mobiles zimeingia sasa mobiles zimechangia sasa watu pia atapestian wanapita tu pale kokote pale wamefikiria sasa nyingine anakuwa hata haoni gari nakuta amegongwa na gari driver pia anakuwa hana makosa lakini sasa kwa sababu ya hizi simu pia zime 
Lazima tujifundishe kutumia simu. What basically people are trying to say is kila mtu akona responsibility ya. Yeah? Kama wewe ni personal driver, please wachi ni mchoyo. Eh? No, no. Manda maku hapa mengangana na viti yake. Uwe ni pele. Mtu hata muangali na nuri yake. Please, unona. Police, the traffic police give back to the society. Na nadhani pia sisi kama wananchi, yeah. as a passenger, as a pedestrian, you have a big role and responsibility to play. Sia ti dereva na overlap ni niwendu unafraya sa hizo. Kumbuka, aki fanya tu mistake kidogo, if you get into an accident, it's your life. You'll pay with your life. Yes. So it's not worth it. How's yeah. your? Sure. Yeah. Na traffic police give back to the society. So. Hey, just in case you never get an opportunity kwa ndani ya matatu, we still search you on the streets. What do you mean we still search them on the streets, JB? Tunaswamisha tu tunapera mba nini? Eh? We still come to the streets to find your opinions. So, that's how... So, exactly. For Take you. it to the streets. Mutu wakiandasha gari na mbio vila anataka, haifai. Baka lasima uendasha gari na sheria mba simewekwa. Sio lasima uendasha na na akiri yako vila unafikiria. Maha watu weshimu sisi watu wa migu. Siku hizi wamebadilisha kidogo lakini wanaenda waki waki wakirudi mahali zilikuwa zinaendeswa vibaya. Sio wote wanapelekanga mzuri. Eh wengine wanaendanga wakiopatenga ngali zingine wanafanya wanasababisha accident. Ingia kwa matatu hata ma driver wenyewe tena aendeshi vizuri. Eh, Juu akifika hata junction ni mi roundabout hakuna kuangalia huku angalia huku. Tasele wanaona kariza huku, sinaingia huku. Kuna janzi huko ndio wanaingia huko tena. Miriam, mamaza kuperemba watu kwa street. Nani, mimi ya mawewe. Yeah. Hmm, actually, I'm going to tweet about that right now. I'm going on Twitter. Matatu Kenya, niseme ujoki yako. We are searching people on the streets. Really? We're going for a commercial break, but you'll yes. be right back. We need to set this, madam. We need to tweet this whole yeah. thing.